Hello and welcome to Action Summer BTS. So today we have a song called um, Yet to Come, the most beautiful moment of your music video. Uh, it's a recent one from like two, three weeks ago. Um, you guys gave me like so much BTS suggestion. Um, and I guess they have so much song. So, you know, it goes on to end. Uh, I was a bit overwhelmed. I didn't know what to do. So I just figured I'd check out a recent song. So I just took BTS, um, you know, this month and see if there was any song. And there was one, so perfect. Uh, 150 million view, of course, it's BTS, but yeah, I figured that you get a, a recent one, sorry, and uh, like, see how good it is, because I feel like most of the songs I checked out were a couple of years old, so it should be quite interesting to see like, um, what kind of music and how they do these days, I guess, that's way to put it, so yeah, should be good, I don't think I have much more to say, uh, so link in the description for the original video, the link to the iGlobal channel, I always want to say, want to say the, the BTS channel, but I guess it's not the same. Uh, the link to my streaming amount, if you want to request uh, a K-pop reaction. Any song, you could donate any amount, you tell me what song, and I do it. Uh, compared to the comments where I can't do all the suggestions, because there's too much, obviously. Just for BTS, I feel like I've got, I don't know, 20 to 50 song suggestions. Um, it is a lot. Yeah. It's like, I appreciate, obviously, all the suggestions. Sometimes, like, when I look at the list of uh, songs that I've written down from people's comments, like... I don't even know what to choose because there's so much. Yeah, I could just choose a random one, obviously. I guess with BTS, there's no, there's no miss, uh, obviously, I guess. So yeah, uh, then it's my Twitter, Discord, Twitch, and BDB if you want to follow me. Let's get into it. Here we go. This part is tagged as my BTS story. Alright. Oh. Desert. Hmm. Alright. They look cool as always. Was it honestly the best? Cause I just wanna see the next put it on it. Good start. Good start. I still don't remember what for like the um, piercing style. I don't know if it's for the music video, it's like the real life style now. It. Is it like Alice in the audience? Okay, chill, I like it. Let's see where the best, okay, so it's like a song, Alice in the audience. This was really easy. Just that music, we're just waiting for long. Obviously, you guys have really like told me how much the lyrics means and how much they put into it, how much subject they might address, so I'm not too surprised. What's up, you know, that pass? Oh. oh, that's a cool visual, okay. That's weird that the song be like the Black Wing Angel. Best is yet to come, huh? Uncomfortable title. I just love music. They don't like being called the best. Bad monster. Every month is my new best. <laughs> cool. Alright. And about it. I like the eggs. So they feel well about being called the best. Understandable. Back to square one. I don't know why. I saw the swing itself is pretty chill and uh, just a wholesome vibe. Uh, it's a simple music video compared to some of the stuff I've seen from them. But I guess it's more about the message than the music video. So I really want to keep the really focus away. Uh, 
That's why people sink you, Jake. But my basis was coming next. What's to live by? What is that to look forward to if, like, you already think that the past was the best, which a lot of us do at different time or overall, but yeah. Good message, good message. We're all happy in a bus. I never felt happy being in a bus personally. <laughs> A very reflective kind of song, yeah. I like it. Like a lot of songs I checked out so far, I had to be explained, like the lyrics and, you know, compared to the story, why they're like uh, eating. This one is more straightforward, I think, yeah. You had to come, the most beautiful moments. I think this one's much more uh, straightforward as far as like, um, um, you know, like the message is like simple and uh, I just get it. I mean, it's like, yeah, um, if you think that your your best moment has already happened in your life, what is the point of keeping going? A lot of people feel that way. Like, you know, my childhood was the best. Not that everyone would say that. I mean, I don't say that. For me, it's like the opposite. Uh, my best moment is probably right now, literally. Uh, actually, like, yeah, this is uh, this is it. Like, this channel is many times, like, the high point of my life right now. And I don't want to say that it will be the high point forever, but it feels like if this isn't it, I won't have any other high points. But at the same time, I guess the point of the song is to say that, yeah, it's always the best moment is yet to come. Whether it's true or not, it's more like thinking like that, that might help achieve that um, that point, you know, if you think that there's always another best moment yet to come, um, I guess you'll have more chance to see it happen. I see it like that, I guess. So, good message in that way, I mean, it's... Um, not like an unusual one, it's a message that you hear quite a bit, um, but by any means, I mean, told by, you know, some, some, uh, someone as massive as BTS, obviously, um, it really told a lot more people. Pretty cool. I also like some of the line in the song, we say like, um, are they feel uncomfortable being called the best? Um, having seen like some of the intro video about them, I definitely can see that they're down to earth. Obviously, um, you know, there's different type of artists and type of music. Um, you know, some a lot of like musicians are down to earth, but also a lot of them, uh, be it like because they really like that, or like as a person, as a rock star, maybe, um, actually would say, like, yeah, I'm the best, of course, I'm the best, that kind of things. But I like BTS saying that, yeah, they feel uncomfortable being called the best. They don't say that they're not the best, they just say that they don't, they feel uncomfortable being called that, which is interesting. In a way, it's like, I don't know. You can also take it that it's still acknowledged they are the best. I don't know. It's interesting. It's interesting. But it's fun to see like, those kind of lyrics in a, um, you know, in a, such a massive song being actually like so down to earth and, uh, and everything. Yeah. They say we're the best, full of these infamous names. We just love music. Promise that we'll keep on coming back for more. That's nice as well, once again. Um, you know, just saying that, yeah, even if, like, they take breaks and stuff like that, you'll see them again. I like that. I like that. Somewhere deep inside your heart, they still lose a young boy. My moment is yet to come. Yeah. And then there was the rap monster part. Every moment is my new best. I like that a lot. Uh, nothing much has changed. I don't know if that's true. There were a lot of changes, but... A new chapter, every moment is my new best. Speaking about just like I did back then. It's interesting. It's really like, I guess for a lot of musicians, like, you know, you start doing music for a very small amount of people, and then you end up doing music, if you get big, for like dozens of thousands of people, to hundreds of thousands, to millions. Um, in the end, the basic thing you do is the same, make music. But uh, yeah, like the scale is different of like the people listening to it. But otherwise, yeah, I guess the thing is the same, doing music. It's interesting, some pretty good line in the song. And as far as the song itself, um, simple music video. I don't know if it's as simple as I said, like, you know, they just don't want to distract from the lyrics. But, uh, you know, it's fun to watch nonetheless. And I really like uh, the music. It's like, 
uh, so far I was like not too hot on some of the softer songs like this from BTS. Um, but this one really does it for me. Yeah, it's a good one. It's definitely a good one. It has, um, you know, that reflective vibe uh, from the lyrics, and the music also gives you that feel. So it's really uh, a great one, yeah. Okay, okay. Great song. Love the reflecti uh, reflectiveness in the lyrics. Okay, okay. Well, a new uh, song I really enjoy from BTS. So that's pretty awesome. That's pretty awesome. Uh, in, I cannot write. In, here we go. Okay, so as always, I appreciate all the comments. Uh, I'm sure like I miss a lot from, from the song and you guys will give me more context about like every single line, which I'm looking forward to. As I say every time, like, um, you can appreciate music and a song on its own. Just like listen to it and enjoying it. Like I listen to a lot of music without even caring about the lyrics or understanding any of the lyrics. Uh, like in different languages and stuff like that. Sometimes the music itself is, you know, the feeling from the music itself is what matters to me. Um, but uh, there's really like arguments to be made that, you know, getting the lyrics will like enhance um, the vibe of the song. If it's really like really deep stuff, it will be enhance so much you can enjoy it because you understand like uh, the meaning plays into everything and the music. So by any means, I appreciate all the comments. Link in the description for the original video. The link to the hype level channel, my Twitter, Discord, Twitch, and believe me, if you want to follow me, my stream elements, if you want to support me. As always, thanks for watching, like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. See you.